Hello, my friends. Today I am sending this beautiful kit, yarn kit, few yarn kits uh, to my student from Australia. And I want to show you closer these threads and tell you more about what projects we plan to make and yes, how we will use these threads. So let's start. First, we can start from this yarn kit. In total, five different colors. It's Sin Italian Viscos. And uh, we will use this kit to create suit mermaid. I want to show you this suit. Uh, this is our new crochet course from our school. It includes a crop top mermaid, crop top and also long skirt. And this all threads my student will use to create a really beautiful smooth transition of colors. Here I used Sapphire look, so I was not able to create smooth transition of colors. Just I made different parts in different colors. But by using uh, threads like this, uh, we can slowly change colors and the lace will be really gorgeous. Also, the same technique we can use here at, the, at our crop top because uh, I already I'm making like this variant. How to do this? This. Just uh, you can change uh, colors in your elements, just you need to have this design. I made it, yes, uh, such design and I made each element uh, in different colors. Just uh, the, at the top part I have more light colors, in the middle middle colors and the most dark at the bottom. And uh, next I will place, I will create composition from all these elements and I will get really incredible result. Just it will be like transition of colors by, even by using elements. <laughs> yes, it's even more interesting. Also, when you are making connections between elements, you need to think about where to use each color. And this all challenge, this all uh, process is uh, very interesting and the result is magical. Also, I have these um, corals, beads and shells to uh, create these decorations at the uh, front side. And each time I need to choose uh, yes, specific colors. Uh, for example, here we have uh, blue, white, turquoise. And for my next project, I have like um, lemon, lime or, and also brown colors. Like this it works. Uh, my student, uh, yes, have just uh, we have chosen together these colors, ivory, uh, different brown colors, and the last is the most dark chocolate color, yes. So, will be really interesting. Uh, 750 grams, it's really enough, because for this crop top we don't need a lot of spreads, maybe 150. And for skirt, it's enough, I uh, think 400 grams will be enough. Here we have even more, so I am sure my student... Uh, will get enough threads for this beautiful suit. Uh, so these threads, uh, I will show you closer now and I will pack them together with you. So first color is ivory, a very nice one. This will be the most light color in our composition. The number is 3187, uh, three cons and each con has 50 grams. Yes, here uh, all cons are the same, just we have different colors. So why we have three cons each time? Because in the beginning of work, we, are, we need to join three threads. We should make some part. After we start to um, change colors, we will cut only one thread like this ivory and we will take second color and we will join it. And again, we will work with three threads, but we will have like this two ivory and one this light brown, yes. Some part of work we will make with this color combination, yes. And after again we will cut one ivory and we will join again uh, next brown color. In such way uh, we can create amazing laces and we can change colors slowly. I think uh, this technique is amazing and I love to, to do projects uh, with uh, threads like this. Yes, it's really something fantastic. And now uh, let's pack our three threads and I will show you second color. And second color is like this. It's a golden brown uh, and uh, this is the most light brown color here. Uh, that's why it will be second one, yes, color in our uh, smooth transition of colors. We have also three cones, so let's pack them to our package. Third color is like cinnamon, and uh, we have two very close. This one is lighter, and next one will be a little bit darker, and it's perfect when you are making a uh, transition of colors. And now, like I told you, we, we have uh, a little bit darker color than previous one. Also three cons and will be really amazing. So let's pack them. And the last should be the most dark. We have here dark chocolate color and also three cons. Each con has 50 grams like this. 
so we have three cons. I forget about numbers, this one is a 9255 number. And all these colors you can find in our uh, store, jtyhouse.net slash store. There we have beautiful threads like this, also Sapphire Lux, Chelebi, Angora Fine. You can visit our store and you can choose some beautiful threads for your crochet projects. Uh, next we have Sapphire Lux, uh, white color, number 415, two cones. Each cone has uh, 100 grams, yes. These two threads, uh, two cones we have, one light pink, it's number... 202 and the last one is very interesting i am sending the last two skeins that i have the color number is uh, 406 like this two cons amazing color these two cons i am sending let's pack everything also uh, we have here a yarn kit for scarf cinderella uh, this uh, con especially this one sapphire looks uh, we will use to middle for middle part to make flowers and rest part of elements we will make by using a uh, warm angora fine this one con i'm sending just like a gift because it's a little bit lighter maybe my student will like it more so she can use this also thread to make this middle part of um, beautiful elements cinderella like this i will show closer this picture so this is our crochet cost uh, you can see closer the design uh, we are making main elements cinderella next uh, we need to join them in total 16 elements if you want you can make it bigger it's your choice after uh, we have this middle part we need to make uh, such beautiful square shape uh, middle part each time and also the last step will be this awesome edging around with um, snowflakes like this i don't know <laughs> with balls looks really pretty and uh, yes uh, i just uh, told you that uh, for middle part for these flowers um, we can use vis viscose like i did it for my original scarf and uh, i used here a viscose ivory color and after this rest part uh, this really big part i made from ivory angora fine yes and also joinings you can make by using uh, this angora fine and edging yes so just um, viscose we have in the fl in our flowers and i think this is a really nice idea because uh, we can clearly see these flowers and they are very pretty because they are a little bit shiny silky looks uh, very uh, very pretty and soft so such design i really enjoy to do this and what is great uh, we can use the same crochet hook for this both threads for sapphire looks and for a thread fillet is the same crochet hook 1.7 millimeters can be two millimeters and also for fillet we can use the same crochet hook so uh, this three different types of threads we can join in one project and everything will be just perfect okay also here we have fabric pattern for crop top mermaid i forget to tell you about this um for my client yes for my student now let's pack these two cons and now this really fantastic balls of thread and fine. The number of this color is 134, 910. And each ball has 50 grams. This color is unique. I have the last six skeins. Uh, I think this scarf will be amazing and really gorgeous. This thread is high quality, tender, uh, very pleasant uh, when you are wearing a scarf like this. Um, so I, I'm using this threads for, for my project so I know um how it looks <laughs> yes in the work and in the end we have really a nice result so we have six balls i will pack them and this color is really amazing and special i think so my friends everything is ready to send uh, we have here high quality threads tasted by me in practice for all my projects uh, we have italian visco sin thread sapphire looks filati and also angora fine and also uh, my student have this high quality crochet courses video tutorials and also pdf lessons with colored schemes with instructions in english and each my lesson is very detailed uh, be sure that you can use this um, tutorials if uh, you are beginning because you will clearly see everything uh, you will have high quality schemes and also you will have instructions also step by step you can watch a video and just repeat after me I think uh, they are really high quality this is all crochet courses and tutorials 
So, uh, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like threads like this or our crochet courses, you can visit our website jtyhouse.net slash store. Uh, you can find there our crochet courses, our uh, yes, beautiful threads, yarn kits, and also magazines. We have two magazines, um, JT House issue 1 and issue 2. If you have any questions, just feel free to ask me. Contact information you have below, below this video. You can send me a message uh, at what's, uh, in WhatsApp or by using email. Uh, I will gladly send you more information and also I can help you to choose beautiful threads for your project. So uh, don't be afraid to ask me anything. <laughs> I will be glad, uh, glad to talk about crocheting, about threads and about tutorials. So, my friends, I wish you all the best, big inspiration, amazing crochet results, and see you very soon at the new videos. Bye-bye for now.